All right, what up, y'all? I'm doing this one today on setting the ball. And that's a term that came from weightlifting. And um, you, know, you see people on these YouTube videos, sometimes they set the ball too high, and sometimes they set the ball too low. And um, it's... it's it, it might, I think it's something subconscious that's going on that uh, what I'm noticing that a lot of folks who are quote unquote successful like to use the poorest people to uh, justify uh, their um, their success or gratify their success, and that's setting the ball really low, you know. Um, in my case, to see some of the most successful uh, uh, entertainment people either copy something that I'm doing with my music or go out of their way or spend resources to attack me. When there's people who are in the, on their level or higher that they could be going after. That's setting the bar really low. Um, you know, I've seen people online saying stuff like, oh, I'm dope in real life. As opposed to who? I, I, that's what I want to know. How, how are you using somebody else to gratify who you are? That's setting the bar really low. You know, I don't particularly care for uh, uh, gang members. And, um, and, um, and I see, um, like, mothers who got single parent mothers who's on welfare or whatever their situation is and they got um tons of kids and all this other stuff and they got their own struggles and um i would never look down on them because i recognize that they rich with love yeah they might not have financial wealth they rich with love or brotherhood which is which is really worth more than money if you use it wisely and um, I speak from experience. I was rich with brotherhood. I was rich with love. You know, t today I'm not. It's, it's been depleted for whatever reason. Um, but I don't set my bar based on what others have or others don't have. And, and it's something that's subconsciously going on. This is why we haven't gone to Mars. This is why we haven't, you know, have more uh, vast uh, uh, um, inventions and, and um and progression in society because we keep letting these folks that we following set the bar and this is it this is the standard this is where it's at this is where it's got to be um it, it, i think it is it's um it's sad but it's a reality people love to set the bar really low um you know uh uh like i said me i set my own progression based on uh what i feel my progression is not based on what other people are doing or what they're wearing or what they stand as all, or what they, uh, you know, because that truly shows somebody's character on a different level. You know, it's one thing if somebody put a camera up your ass or follow you around the street when they don't, when you don't know they following you or put a microphone on you or whatever lame shit they doing. But it's another thing when you see people setting the bar low. It's like, my man. Why would you use somebody who you feel you're more successful than to use them to gratify that you're successful? That's the, I, I, that that right there. That's like the sun saying, "Oh, look, I'm better than the moon." Uh, you know, uh, or it's it's so many other analogies you could use. But setting the bar is it's just a metaphorical term that's that's just to show your progression. Or, or to assess your progression or your success, and and um and, and and like I said, this is just my view. A lot of time when I talk, and it, obviously you know who I'm talking to. Whether others uh, choose to listen for entertainment factors or whatever, or use it as a discussion. Um, but um, it, it, it's it's so many analogies. It's like it's like a professional ball player looking at a a, a dude in college, like looking.